Hi, Teresa. It's Jory. And I am very excited to talk to you today about all of the things that I plan on doing this summer. But most importantly, the thing I'm most excited about this summer is reading. I know. Huge shocker. So, what am I going to be reading? Let me tell you. I have created a book reading challenge, so if you want to join me, I'll also be making this in list form and putting it on my blog. You can find a link to it up here, there. Yeah. So, without further ado, book one. The first book on this reading challenge is probably one that we can all think of off the top of our head. It's that book that we bought a long time ago, and it got added to a to-read pile, and may or may not be an entire shelf in my room. You've always wanted to read it, but you just never got around to it because all of these new books got in the way. So pick one of those. That's book number one. Book two. I have been really into poetry books recently, so find a book of poetry. Read it. Let me know what you're reading because I want to know. Um, yeah, I am super excited. Let me know down in the comments. Book three. I'm going to suggest that you pick books based off of the color of their cover. I know we say never judge a book by its cover, but it's a fun way to pick some books. So pick a red book. And book four, pick a blue book. Book five, read a book from before you were born. So one that was published before the year of your birth. It's going to be probably amazing literature, but even if it's not, at least you might get a really good kick out of it. Book six, in the same suit, pick a book that was published this year. Book seven, there are lots of classics out there that you probably didn't have to read for high school. Reading the classics is a really good way to get better at reading and enjoy the art that is literature. So find a classic that you haven't ever read before and open it up and fight your way through it because you'll probably gain something from it. Book eight. One that you learned of because of a TV show or a movie. One that comes to mind is Ready Player One or Darkest Minds. Find one that you read and that you heard about because of a movie. So you saw the movie first. This is one of the only times I'm going to say read a book because you saw the movie rather than hear about the movie, read the book, go watch the movie. That's usually my preferred way of doing things. Book nine. Find a book published in the last five years. So not this year. Not before you were born, but within the last five years, if you need some of those recommendations, I have a few. I can let you know. I will put a list down down there. Yeah, all of the lists. All of the book lists. I am very excited to make this list. Finally, book 10. Our last book is a book recommended by a friend. So whether that's one of your friends, whether that's one of my friends, whether that's, I don't know, a teacher that you trust, or if you want me to be that friend, I am obviously already giving you book suggestions down there, so that can count. If you want to join me in this challenge, let me know in the comments. Um, we can keep each other accountable. I'll be doing this through Goodreads and also probably Instagram. I'll put those links up here um, and also down there. <laughs> and Teresa, when you get videos put up, they will go over here. Up there. Yeah. Right? Right? There. Click there and find Teresa's videos because she's an awesome human and I am very excited to be doing this with her. Till next time, Teresa. See you then. If you want to hear more about me and what I'm doing, especially what I'm doing in my internship this summer and what I'm doing in my life after this summer, like and subscribe and make sure that little notifications bell is turned on. Otherwise, it'll be harder for you to know when I post things. I'm so glad you're here and I look forward to doing my life with you. So, thanks. <laughs> Bye. Also, Teresa, did I tell you about this shirt? I am super, super excited about this shirt. Yeah, all of the merch came in while I was flying back home, so <laughs> get ready for merch.